Yeah, the Canada World Cups, uh, Canada and America World Cups were quite tricky for me. Being in the middle of the season, uh, my coach and I decided that, you know, we really needed to do a big a block of training leading into those races to make sure that I was set up perfectly for London. So, you know, I went to Canada quite fatigued because of the jet lag uh, and all the traveling thrown in. Um, I didn't manage to recover that much and uh, I could really feel it on race day there. I, you know, in the beginning I had no legs. And then the next weekend in America, um, I had a bit more time to recover and uh, I was feeling a lot better, obviously. And yeah, it was, like I said, a surprise win. I wasn't focusing on those events. So it's really great to go out there and, and win a race uh, when you feel, or I personally feel I wasn't at my best and the numbers showed it. Yeah, I just got back from America yesterday and um, obviously feeling a bit of jet lag. Uh, Struggled to fall asleep in the evening and really tired in the morning, but that's typical when you fly east over time zones. You know, now more than ever, it's really important to focus on my nutrition uh, um, in the mornings, especially to get me going. And obviously coffee is a big ingredient in that. But then also fueling up for the day's training that's, that's coming up and making sure that my body is properly fueled before I head out for training. So my first training session today will be a 17 minute uh, session on the trainer, on the indoor trainer. And that'll basically be a, a session designed to estimate how fatigued I am before I go out onto my first uh, intervals for the day. Um, it's a test uh, my coach Jeroen Swart has uh, developed and it's a pretty accurate gauge of whether or not uh, your body is ready for you know, a heavy training load or whether I should take it easy for the rest of the day. The numbers were average to a little bit low, but I figured you know, with the jet lag, it might just be that I need to, to wake up a bit more. So I'm gonna head out onto the road now and uh, see how things go. Yeah, so basically I went out onto the road this morning. I did my uh, a warm up uh, and uh, yeah, just felt really sleepy. Um, my body didn't feel too bad. I wasn't so stiff or anything like that. Um, I could just feel that uh, I wasn't going to make the numbers that were necessary today. So I've decided to come back this afternoon and, and take it easy, maybe have a good sleep and uh, then do another easy ride on the trainer this evening. Um, we do this basically just to keep the body ticking over, obviously burning calories, um, but you know, it allows you to recover at the same time.